Hi, this is a quick tutorial on how to map a network drive for the DIR-890L. That's the new one that looks like a crab. A lot of people are having difficulty uh, mapping uh, drives to this. Um, once you've uh, plugged in the drive, you've got power to your drive and it's been recognized uh, in the web browser. You'll be able to go to your share port and you just go up to your share, your share port. This is the default screen for it as you can see. So just go up to the top left hand corner and click on that and it gives you in blue the name of your drive. This is very important. You, you want to write this down or copy it if you can. Um, then you go to your map your network drive screen and uh, in here you want to type in backslash backslash 192.168.0.1 backslash and then the name of your hard drive which is what we found over here so you type in this name right here right there right at the end then you pick a drive letter in this case I picked Z okay so I picked uh, Z and then hit finish and then you end up with a with the, the drive uh, mapped it's that simple don't use the SharePoint uh, web links to try to map your drive because it'll puke on you okay and as far as the security goes this was done with uh, network discovery is off turn off file and print sharing and turn off uh, public folder sharing so all of this stuff was off on my home network so I have uh, total security and I'm using the Windows firewall plus uh, uh, my Commodore uh, uh, firewall so there you have it so just to recap, type in one uh, backslash backslash 192.168.0.1 and the name of your hard drive, which is found in the share share uh, SharePort Web Access from off of the default screen. Come over and hit that little icon, and that will give you the name of your drive. And that is all that's required in order to map a drive. USB or U USB 3 or USB 2. Now this is Paco. I hope this uh, helps you out. Thanks. Bye.